chanting of the name of Ram that Lord Shiva is part of. Let's come to Lord Shiva. Kopeshwar Mahadev Ki. Ganga Taranga Ramaniya Jata Kalapam Gauri Nirantara Vibhushita Vama Bhagam Narayana Priya Madanga Madapaharu Varanasi Purapatim Bhaja Vishwanatham Whether he is Vishwanath at Kashi or he is Gopeshwar in Vrindavan or he is Chakleshwar at Govardhan or he is Nandishwar at Nandagram or he is Kundeshwar in Vrindavan or he in Radha Kund or he is Kameshwar at Kamvan or he is Bhuvaneshwar Mahadev in Bhuvaneshwar or he is Harihara at Harihara Kshetra in Navadweep. All that he does is chanting the names of the Lord. This is what he is busy doing. <laughs> so much so that Mother Parvati asked on our behalf. She asked Sri Shambhu Mahadev, Lord Shiva. O Shiva, O Prabhu, O Ishwara. You have chanted the thousand names of Vishnu. But however, devotees in Melbourne don't have time to chant thousand names of Vishnu, said Mother Parvati. <laughs> She's Jagata Janani. She's the mother of the creation. So she said, somehow they don't have time to chant the Vishnu Sahasranam, which is also quoted in Chaitanya Charitamrita as Brihat Sahasranam. <coughs> so somehow they don't have time. So what does the mother do? She's asking the father for some concession for her child. Mother Parvati is asking Lord Shiva, Kenopayena laguna Vishnu nama sahasrakam Pathyate pandita enrityam shrotum ichamyaham Prabhu. Oh dear Prabhu, my children in Bhumandala, they don't have time to chant the thousand names of Vishnu. Can you give me a shortcut? A shortcut formula that I can share with my children by which they have to do less input and more output they get? Oh. Ishwara said, yes. Oh, Devi, I knew you will ask this. So I've kept a solution behind my back. What is that? Please chant. Shri Rama Rama Rameti. Shri Rama Rama Rameti. Rame Rame Manorame. Rame Rame Manorame. Sahasranama Tattulyam Sahasranama Tattulyam Rama Nama Varanane Rama Nama Varanane Those who are South Indians are almost remembering M.S. Subalakshmi in their mind. <laughs> you know? She chants it so beautifully. Even now in, in Tirumala Tirupati, Venkateshwara's hill, she sings and wakes up the Lord with her Suprabhatam. Yes. Hmm? Very great devotee. So Lord Shiva says, Oh Devi, if a jiva doesn't have time to chant the thousand names of Vishnu, no problem. The shortcut is all that the jiva has to do is thrice say, please repeat, Shri Rama, Shri Rama, Shri Rama, Iti, Bas. Shri Rama, 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 Iti. But how should you chant? Rame, Rame, Mano, Rame. You have to chant with devotion. If one chants with faith and devotion, then Sahasranama Tattulyam, the thousand names of Vishnu, equal the three utterance of the name of Sri Ramachandra. Sri Ramachandra Bhagavaniki. Mother Parvati is very impressed. She tells Lord Shiva, Oh, that was a very brief answer. Please tell me something about Ram. Some glories about the name of Sri Ram. Only then I will be inspired to share the message. You are just giving me the, the equation that thousand names of Vishnu equals three names of Ramachandra or Ram. Please tell me more about this name. Do we all want to hear what Lord Shiva said in this regard? Yes. If you are not interested, we can change the topic. No. If you are interested, we can say a Hari Bol. Hari Not the Ekadashi Hari Bol. Imagine this Prasad in your belly and then say Hari Bol. So Lord Shiva started speaking the glories of Ram Mahima. He told Mother Parvati, Oh Devi, these two syllables, Ra and Ma, are so powerful. They are so powerful 
that even if the whole sky is used as canvas, even if the whole even if the whole sky is used as canvas, and the whole of oceanic water body is used as ink. The whole sky is used as canvas and the whole ocean water body is used as ink. Still, there is no one, including Anantashesh, who can write the glories of one utterance of Ramnam. This is how glorious it is, O Dev.